Hello everyone. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of candlestick patterns. So what exactly is a candlestick? Well, it's a visual representation of information about an asset's price movement. Candlestick charts have become a cornerstone of technical analysis, offering traders a quick interpretation of price information with just a glance at a few price bars. Now let's focus on the daily chart. In this context, each candlestick details a single day's trading and features three key components. The body, representing the open to close range, the wick or shadow, indicating the intraday high and low, and the color, revealing the direction of market movement. The body can be green or white, signaling a price increase, while a red or black body denotes a price decrease. Over time, individual candlesticks form patterns that traders use to identify major support and resistance levels. There's a plethora of candlestick patterns that highlight opportunities within the market. Some shed light on the balance between buying and selling pressures, while others pinpoint continuation patterns or market indecision. Before you venture into trading, it's crucial to acquaint yourself with the basics of candlestick patterns and understand how they can guide your decisions. Now, let's explore six bullish candlestick patterns. First up, we have the hammer. This pattern comprises a short body with a long, lower wick and is typically found at the bottom of a downward trend. The hammer indicates that despite selling pressures throughout the day, robust buying pressure ultimately drove the price back up. The body color can vary, but a green hammer suggests a stronger bull market than a red one. Next, we have the inverted hammer, a similarly bullish pattern distinguished by its long upper wick and short lower wick. It signifies buying pressure followed by selling pressure that wasn't potent enough to drive the market price down. The inverted hammer suggests that buyers will soon take control of the market. Moving on to the bullish engulfing pattern, which consists of two candlesticks. The first is a short red body entirely engulfed by a larger green candle. Despite the second day opening lower, the bullish market propels the price up, indicating a clear win for buyers. Lastly, the piercing line, another two-stick pattern, features a long red candle followed by a long green candle. A significant gap down usually exists between the closing price of the first candlestick and the opening of the green one, indicating strong buying pressure that pushes the price up to or above the mid-price of the previous day. Understanding these bullish candlestick patterns can serve as indicators for traders, signaling potential reversals and opportunities to open long positions for profit in upward trajectories. So, keep an eye out for these patterns as you navigate the exciting world of trading. The Morningstar candlestick pattern is often seen as a beacon of hope in a gloomy market downtrend. It's a three-stick pattern with a short-bodied candle nestled between a long red and a long green one. Traditionally, the star should have no overlap with the longer bodies as the market gaps both on open and close. This pattern signals a subsiding selling pressure from the first day, hinting at the emergence of a bullish market on the horizon. Now let's talk about the three white soldiers pattern, which unfolds over three days. It features consecutive long green or white candles with small wicks, opening and closing progressively higher than the preceding day. This robust bullish signal emerges after a downtrend, reflecting a steady surge in buying pressure. Shifting gears to bearish candlestick patterns, these typically manifest after an uptrend, indicating a point of resistance. Heightened pessimism about the market often prompts traders to close their long positions and initiate short positions to capitalize on the anticipated price decline. Enter the hanging man, the bearish counterpart of the hammer. It shares the same shape, but materializes at the uptrend's conclusion. It signals a substantial sell-off during the day, yet buyers manage to push the price back up. This pronounced sell-off is often interpreted as a sign that the bulls are losing control of the market. 
Next in line is the shooting star, mirroring the inverted hammer but forming in an uptrend. It boasts a small lower body and a long upper wick. Typically, the market will gap slightly higher on opening, rallying to an intraday high before settling just above the open reminiscent of a star descending to the ground. The bearish engulfing pattern unfolds at the uptrend's end, with the first candle having a small green body engulfed by a subsequent long red candle. This signifies a peak or slowdown in price movement, serving as a harbinger of an impending market downturn. The deeper the second candle plunges, the more significant the impending trend reversal is likely to be. We have the evening star, a three candlestick pattern akin to the bullish morning star. It comprises a short candle sandwiched between a long green candle and a sizable red one. This signals a reversal of an uptrend, and its impact is particularly potent when the third candlestick erases the gains of the first candle. Three Black Crows This pattern comprises three consecutive long red candles with short or non-existent wicks. Each session opens at a similar price to the previous day, but selling pressures drive the price lower with each close. Traders interpret this pattern as the beginning of a bearish downtrend, as sellers have dominated the market for three successive trading days. Now, onto the dark cloud cover pattern, signaling a bearish reversal, casting a shadow over the optimism of the previous day. It consists of two candlesticks, a red one opening above the previous green body and closing below its midpoint. This signals the bears taking control, pushing the price sharply lower. Short wicks suggest a decisively strong downtrend. Let's talk about continuation candlestick patterns. If a pattern doesn't signal a change in market direction, it's a continuation pattern. These help traders identify periods of rest, market indecision, or neutral price movement. Enter the doji. When market open and close nearly match, forming a cross or plus sign, it indicates a struggle between buyers and sellers, resulting in no net gain. Alone, a doji is a neutral signal, but it can be found in reversal patterns like the bullish morning star or bearish evening star. Next up, the spinning top pattern featuring a short body between equal length wicks indicating market indecision. While it's a benign signal on its own, it can hint at future developments, signifying a loss of control by current market pressures. Let's explore falling three methods and rising three methods for predicting trend continuation. The falling three methods bearish pattern consists of a long red body, followed by three small green bodies, all within the range of the bearish bodies. This indicates that bulls lack the strength to reverse the trend. Conversely, the rising three methods bullish pattern comprises three short red candles within the range of two long ones, showing that despite selling pressure, buyers retain control. To truly master reading candlestick patterns, practice entering and exiting trades based on the signals they provide. If you're not ready for live markets, hone your skills in a risk-free environment by opening a demo account. And always remember, while candlestick patterns are excellent for predicting trends quickly, they should complement other forms of technical analysis to confirm the overall trend. Thank you.